Okay, so today we're going to talk about factoring with a coefficient greater than 1. So here we have 6x squared plus x minus 2. So you can notice that the coefficient out front is greater than 1, 6. Now you can't just solve this problem using the regular box method. You like plug stuff in, do that. So this, this requires a different method. I like to call this method the easy method because it's much easier than the method that was taught to me in middle school. Sorry teachers, it's true. Okay, so the first step is you take the coefficient out front with x squared and you multiply it by this number here, the one that's just hanging without a variable. So 6 times negative 2 is negative 12. Now we see we have to list all of 12's factors. So the stuff that when you multiply together it equals 12. So 1 and 12, 2 and 6, 3 and 4, and then 6 and 2, 12 and 1. So notice this negative, either one of these numbers can be negative. So to figure out which one's going to be negative, we can use this x here. So these two numbers have to multiply to get 12, or negative 12, and then they have to add up to get 1. So, 1 and 12, that's a difference of 11, so this is not going to work. 2 and 6, that's a difference of about 4, so that's not going to work. 3 and 4, okay, so if we have negative 4, we're going to have negative 1, so it's not going to be negative 4 and 3. But if we try negative 3 and 4, we're going to get 1. So this is the correct, the correct um, numbers that multiply up to get negative 12. So the next step that we do is we, so we solved all of this, let me just erase it. The next step, okay, so we figure out is negative 3 and 4. The next step that we do is we write it out. 6x squared minus 3x plus 4x minus 2. And you can see that the this is basically the same as this. It's just a little bit more simplified here. Because negative 3 plus 4, that's going to be that's gonna be 1, 1x. One but the reason we're going to do this is because we're going to factor stuff out and then we're going to, we're going to, we'll, you'll just see it. Okay, so let's just split these into two parts. So this is the first part and this is the second part. So you'll notice here, you can factor out a 3x. So 3x times 2x minus 1. That's the first part. Now the second part, you can see, you can factor out a 2. So plus 2 times 2x minus 1. Okay. Once you've reached this step here, let me just erase this one, so we're no longer in step one. Once you reach this step here, you can combine like terms. So we can see that we have two two x minus one, so that can be one of the factors, I guess, and then three x plus two. So you just take these outside numbers, outside of the parentheses numbers, and you add them together. And then whatever this one is, you just have one of these in the final answer. So that's our answer. And you'll see that if we do this little box, 3x plus 2, 2x minus 1, 6x squared minus 3x, 4x minus 2, 6x squared minus 3x plus 4x minus 2, 6x squared minus plus x minus 2. So, ding! That's how you factor with a coefficient greater than 1.